Hello guys, Washala2014 here, and uh, today is going to be a different video because I made a discovery at my dad's place in Bristol. And yeah, you remember my laptop video I did of my Windows XP laptop? Well, I found another laptop, it's a HP. It was about there, and then um, I thought I'd dig it out and run it, and I was delighted to see that it had Windows 7 on it. Which is, again, one of my favourite, my second favourite Windows operating system. And I thought I'd, yeah, no, I wanted to do a video of a Windows 7 laptop or PC. So, so, yeah, I thought I'd do a video, another laptop video for today. Oh, so this is a HP. It's a, it's a HP, it's a HP G62. Can't remember when this was made, but I think I'll have a look online. Looking at this basics, looking at all the things, there's charger port there. That's a USB port there, that's the DVD space there. And of course looking at the looking at this and all that. HP. Yeah, I'm just having a look at that, but it doesn't say like when it was made. So you can see it runs Windows 7 Home Premium. Yeah, this is all your basic things here. Yeah, I'm gonna open up and this is the back, you've got the hinges there that hold it in place. So yeah, we're gonna open it up and have a look at you know the this is like the mouse bit and the and mouse here. There's a keyboard with all the keys you need. Yeah, and this is yeah. See, this is a HP G sixty two, and and yeah, and this is the char. This is the charger where it goes in. Oh, I'm just gonna plug it in. This is where the charger goes, and of course I do use it. I have a US. B charger which I stick in here for it to use. Now oh, just figuring out how to there we go. I'll charge my phone in there. I'm gonna have a look at the charger now. See so yeah, this is the charger here, it's that it uses to charge it, charge its battery. Have a quick look at that. So yeah, I mean, it is a bit dusty because it's not been used in a while. And we're going to power up. HP logo there. Now this takes me back. I love that. Now that is one of my main childhood sounds. Now there's four accounts here and you know I always used to Yeah and I always used to because I used to go on this laptop all the time like back in 2013 when I was like 10 or 11. So we'd go on guest. Want to welcome the Windows 7 Home Premium. If you can see.
is taking a bit. There we go. We're on the. There we go. We're on the main screen now. So you got this bit here, which um, which I'll close. There's the time and there's the time and the date here. There's the volume, your battery. See ninety nine percent. We've got all these. We've got all these here. That's telling me to run HP Advisor under standard account. See, this is a guest account that I used. So yeah, all that there is. Yep. Of course, there's Internet Explorer here, which is very outdated. HP Advisor. That's Windows Media Player. There's all your Windows Explorer files. Which I think you'll load. Yeah, this is all like there's not there's not much on here. Just having a look through. Cool, I remember I used to play Minecraft on this. See in 2013, 2012. No, that was those were the days. Has all this. I think that's desktop shortcuts. This computer, so it's got the local disk has a total of 282 gigabyte and the recovery drive has 15.3 gigabyte. There's a network. Hmm. Anyway, we'll, oh, it's just loading. Nothing's come up, so we'll close that. So you got Skype here. God, I I remember playing Roblox back in the day on this laptop in about 2013. I think that's photo. You got iTunes, McAfee Security, Real Player. Oh, look, The Sims. I mean, I mean, I never played The Sims, but don't know if my don't know if my dad did or his girlfriend. I'm not sure. And you've got something called Driver Detective. I'm not sure what that is. Norton Security and Browser Choice. Adobe Breeder 9. Got this debug thing. And you've got Google Chrome, which I'm using a bit. Recycle Bin, this the Striving Test Success. Then Kodak Gallery. And then we go over to Flipshare, which I have had a look, but there's no there's no flip camera videos on there, sadly. And you've got Visit eBay, which uh, which I have been doing, and I can still use the internet on that. But also, life support for Windows 7 ended very recently this year. About start of the year. But I can still use the internet on this, but just have to be careful with what you put in. Like passwords. I've got this Leximark productive things. Report. They got Robots Player, which yeah, I always used to go on that back in the day. Quick Time Player. And there's Magnifier and the Photo and Video Editor. Yeah, and also Solve PC Issues. Well, I'm not going to bother with that for now. Of course, this is like. Then we got here. We got the Magnifier, Google Chrome. Which you know, got this. This HP Wireless Assistant calculator, Flipshare, Sims, is it eBay? It's getting started. Windows Media Center, Sticky Notes, and Snipping Tool. And then you've got all programs, which are you? Then 
And you can actually search all your programs here. And you've got this bit as well, you've got guest, this is like your account, documents, pictures, music, games, computer, control panel, devices, printers, default programs and help. I'm not sure, I mean, I'll try and get to that in a bit, but it's like when it tells you like what windows you're running. And of course, this is like where you shut down. You can also switch user, you can log off, you can lock, you can restart, sleep and hibernate. So yeah, this is the control panel where it adjusts your computer settings. Yeah, you've got system and security, network and internet, hardware and sound, programs, user accounts, family safety, appearance and personalization, clock, language and region, and ease of access. Yeah, I think I'll go into this just to see. Yeah, I'm just having a look. This is like the themes you've got. You've got Windows 7. You got like Oh you got like themes or architecture characters, landscapes nature scenes and the United Kingdom Fiend backgrounds Windows 7 Basic Windows Classic Oh yeah, I like that That's kind of like Windows XP Oh god High contrast 2, high contrast black, high contrast white. I'll go back to the basic. So, yeah, just having a look at all the different themes. Yeah, it says Windows Defender is out of date and virus protection is, there's not much on here. Oh, don't want to do that. Anyway, I'm trying to find like where it says what Windows you have, but yeah, I'll find that in a bit. Well, so we're going to go and visit eBay UK and just demonstrate the use of the internet on this. It does take a lot bit of a while to load. Try again. And there we go. It's loaded. Yeah, um, we're on uh, eBay. We're on eBay now. We're just going to search like washing machines. We've got a washing machine, we'll enter. There you go, some sorts of machines like Candy, oh, that's Portable, Vestal, Electra, Beko, Hotpoint, Logic, Inset, you know, all sorts. And we'll open up a new tab. Go on YouTube. 
YouTube actually still works on this. I'll go and type in my channel. Yeah, this is the Vintage Boy 34's Hoover Logic washer dryer. Just try and see if I've. Yeah, there's my channel here, Washer 2014. It will load in a bit, just takes a while sometimes. There's my Interstate Evolution video and my top channels over here for the people that you should subscribe to the most. And this was a, there's a new sea that I saw a couple of days ago. Just having a look at the comments, which I will reply to soon. So yeah, this was this is just a quick demonstration of the internet. Yeah, and I'll be I'll pause this video and then I'll then I'll look at like system information that says what Windows you use. So yeah, be back in a bit. Uh, so I managed to find it. It's this is the basic information about your computer. So it's Windows Edition, Windows 7 Home Premium. Got the Windows logo there. It's copyright 2009, which is the year that Windows 7 was released. I was only I was only seven years old when Windows 7 came out. So it's a 64-bit operating system. Manufacturer is HP, model is a HP G62 notebook PC, has a rating of 4.1, doesn't have any, does not, not available for a processor or RAM, it's no pen and touch, and yeah I think that's about it. And the extended support for Windows 7, it ended on January the 14th 2020, so actually it wasn't that long ago that it ended and yeah I, I was 18 when when it ended and I'm 18 now so yeah so that's just how I found it so yeah initial release date 22nd of July 2009 and extended support ended on January the 14th, 2020. And also this bit here is, it's like cracked, but it's been like that for a long time. Yeah, and also this, this like shows the desktop and all that. So anyway, I think that's about it now. And we're going to shut down. That's famous shutdown noise on Windows 7. It says shutting down now. Yeah, Windows 7 Home Premium. Just gonna wait for it to shut down. And that's it, power is off. Just have one last look before. Alright. Okay guys, hope you enjoyed watching this video. Thank you for watching. If you did enjoy it, then leave a like. And if you are new to my channel, then please don't forget to subscribe and turn the notification bell on so you never miss out on any of my latest content and uploads. Alright, see you guys another time. Goodbye and take care and stay safe.